That's right. Look at me. Look at my new car. Look at the inside. Like, all leather interior. Like, the seats, the dashboard, even the steering wheel is made with leather. And I like how I'm able to see, but when you look at the outside, it's like you can't see what's inside the car. So it's pretty dope. I had to get this bad boy because you know what? It's it's October. It's time for me to splurge on another car. Like, why not, you know? Hey, got a client. Well, actually, it's just Nancy's son who's looking to get back something that was stolen. And, yeah, that Nancy. The one who punched keys in Samurai. Oh, no. Oh, one more thing. If you could recover this gong's wheels, too, that'd be real nice. So... You in? If so, find the details attached. Okay, well, let's take a look here. There's this old saying, if it wasn't for fools, there would be no sages. The same is true for fixers. The fool who needs your help is a man named Dan. Dan has a gambling problem. Oh god, really? Lately, he managed to lose his car in a game of cards. To tell the truth, the ride's no great loss or anything. This guy isn't short on cars. What was valuable, however, was the one-of-a-kind bootleg samurai recording stowed in the trunk. How did our fool come into possession of it, you ask? Well, he's Nancy's son. The same Nancy who played keyboard for the band in the days when that snot-nosed boy used to call me Auntie. Aww. Rogue doesn't like being called Auntie. You'll get that album for me, but tell- Sorry. Gut tells me they haven't pawned it off just yet. It's probably still stashed somewhere around the place. And if you can swing it, grab Dance Card 2 for a little bonus, I'll snap you the coordinates of the guy holding the goods. And be aware. He licks the boots of the Sixth Street Gang, so expect to deal with another fool, a stubborn one. I do love a good challenge, so let me just, you know, do my little sneaky Sanity. sneak here. Shit, hold on. Let me just dash on by. No, you didn't see me. You did not see me. Stop it. Damn, I can't really... Okay, hold on. Hold on. I see a camera right there. So, let me turn that off. Oh, I saw another camera, so... Nope, you did not see me. Cut it out. The more I get used to doing these side missions, the more it's helping me practice on getting good at being sneaks, you know? I know in the beginning of the game, I used to go in, dive in, just mess everything up and, you know, call it a day, but I feel like this game has really taught me to actually be a little bit better on just taking care of things the right way. Especially since I know a couple of fixers who prefer me to do things delicately and carefully. Because it does it does pay to, you know. Oh. Nah, you did not you did not see me cut it out. Fuck, they saw me. Oh, come on, what the hell you want me to do? Okay. Let me see this first. Who's coming in? Shit. Hurry up. Oh, shit! This gun is crazy. But you know what? I'm just gonna use my, uh, Kintana, so... Ugh, this sucks. I wasn't really trying to do a lot of stuff, but you know what, I guess... 
I guess sometimes it doesn't really pay to sneak. Oh lord, I don't know what to do. Okay, hold on. I got this, I got this. I know I managed to dismantle a couple dozen guns, so I have a good amount of stim packs or, you know, med kits for me to use. Shit. Is that... Okay. Yeah, it sucks, but it seems like I have to kill everyone here. Is that a camera? Let me turn that off. Ooh. Ew, stop being a jerk. Oh, wait, wait. The blue leg. Okay. Wow, this is insane. Like, I have a whole dozen people on my ass right now. Oh, shit! Yo! Yo! Where he went? Shit! He just bum rushed inside the door. Oh my god, this is insane. He just went in like Sonic right now. Okay, where's the recording? Right here? Johnny Shoes. I got the shard, I got the card keys. Blew my vocal cords out so hard I couldn't speak for a week. <sighs> Must have been fun to watch. What, the gig? No, you not speaking for an entire week. Ah, uh, V, that's mean. And Johnny hasn't said anything yet, so it's like, whatever. Okay, so... Donde esta el cajo? Wait, did it ask right here? No, no swing. Come on. Come on. Where are you running? Shit. You know, you can try and speedy Gonzalez your way into winning, but I have a Katana that does almost a thousand damage points. So you really think. You really think. Come on. You really think we're gonna lose. I'm not. Alright, let's go. Alright, uh, I'm not trying to scratch the car because that would suck. Ooh, ooh, this is a drifter, alright. Ooh, okay. Thankfully, the drop off is around the corner. And one thing I do appreciate about Cyberpunk is no. Oh shit, I need, oh yo, I need some good car insurance because the way I drive here is just criminal. I'm just glad I'm not dealing with a car chase on top of doing some of these missions because Lord knows. Lord, the gaming gods know. What the hell? I was backing into a big parking spot and somehow this car just magically appear out of thin air come on man this game with the amount of quote unquote patches it's still glitching stupid look at look at this character oh now now it wants to load okay huh what bootlegs what are you talking about the samurai concerts the ones you hired me to find why are you blowing smoke in my face? Ooh, yeah, totally. Why didn't you say so? Shit, man, Shimura. Get the wheels, too? You scared right now? What? That not allowed? You know how hard it is when your parents famous? You don't. Nobody does. Maybe you're an Obu Arasaka. Who the hell is getting beat right now? Because I hear him getting jumped. You don't get along with your mom? <laughs> you know, I don't even remember the last time I called her mom. Damn, that's sad. Don't even call her Bess Isis or Mother or Nancy. 
Oh, come The on. incredible one and only best ISIS. <gasps> Shit. Spark downstairs. Keys are in the ignition. What? For real? That's fucking far out, Shum. I won't forget this. Nice. And I can't believe that's Nancy's kid. Like, that's a small world. How is she? Hold on. A gig well done, V. Our client's satisfied not only to get his hands on that recording, but the wheels too. A satisfied client means a satisfied fixer. Hell, you should be satisfied too. Contracts closed and payments on its way. As long as you don't ask me about the parking, then we're good. One last thing, there is a bonus reward waiting for you at the nearest drop point. Question is, how near? Ugh, I guess I'll run. Because it's no use for me to just get my car to, if it's like around the corner, so... Okay, so I wonder what's the bonus? More money, hopefully? Yay, I got $11,825. I wish real life was like this, where I do one gig and I get like 10 Gs off of it. Like, that would be so convenient. Okay, so this is a side street place. Oh, Sebastian. Martha Fricks and Gustavo Orta. Vista del Rey's own Romeo and Juliet. You know that story. Of course. This one's not so Who doesn't? Martha is in a coma in the hospital. Oh, come on. Her father wants Gustavo to pay. Why? Enter V. Demand quick payment. Details attached. Okay, so the world is built on certain rules. Rules that don't appear out of nothing which grew from the blood and mistakes of our predecessors. These rules are meant to protect us. But the young disregard them. They believe they are special, that they are not held to the same rules, that fate is theirs to tell. Yeah, it sounds like my cousins who like to not listen and look where they're at. Martha f uh, Freaks? believe the same and now sleeps in a coma after taking a bullet to the head <gasps> oh my god martha you crazy for that the streets tell me this is her punishment for abandoning family the girl turned from her own father nolan freaks to side with the enemy gustavo orta if she took a bullet to her head where's gustavo like what is he doing how is he repaying her back? Because that's just crazy. But what the street says does matter. Not to no one. He believes Gustavo is solely responsible for what happened to his daughter. Let's fulfill the wish of a father desperate for revenge. He's paying after all. Go to Gustavo's apartment. Deal with him. Don't worry about authorization. My netrunner made sure you don't run into any problems. And FYI. If you hadn't caught on yet, Gustavo is Valentino's. Nolan is 6th Street. Stay sharp. Oh, come on, bro. Valentino's? This is one of Jackie's boys, then. Because Jackie is in Valentino's. Come on, man. This sucks. Wow, I definitely love the graffiti on this elevator. It's beautiful, actually. Alright, so I gotta go to the 32th floor. What kind of apartment building is this where it has 32 floors? That's, that's a lot of cleaning for the janitors. So this is what the apartment looks like. Okay. Damn, I gotta force it. Can I not force it open? Like. Who's there? Gotta see Gustavo. Who? Think you got the wrong address. Oh, come on, bro. Stop making that hard for me. Gotta see Gustavo. Who? 
think you got the wrong address. Okay, I guess I guess I gotta force it open. Right. To show you a real oh shit! All right, I guess I gotta kill him and his voice too. Like this is so awkward. Ooh, ooh, I'm taking a lot of bullets here. Did you say you're gonna run my pockets? What the hell is this? TikTok? Make his pockets hurt. Do -do 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 -do. Wait, this was. Did I kill him? I did. Hold on. Let me read the conversation. There's a problem? Question mark. You heard what happened. Those bendejos from Six. Question mark. What about them? You must find them and thank them for me. I pay well. Why ask me? Can't drag my people into this. And I hear you used to have the talent for giving thanks. Not wrong, am I? No, it's true. Used to is right. Testing the waters? Fine. I'll double the pay. Double of zero is still zero. Looking to start a private war with 6th Street? You asked the wrong man. I'm gonna take his gun. Alright, so... I feel bad because... Oh, not anymore, because you're shooting me. I don't feel bad anymore. I'm just doing my job and y'all shooting me? Like, come on, man. I killed your leader, like... Get over it. You too. Where you at? Next. I was trying to be friendly. I was trying not to end in any bloodshed. But you know what? Since y'all want to do things the hard way, I guess I gotta kill. I'll take that. I'll take that. I'll take the money. I'll take the drinks. I'll give the drinks to my work wife because she loves alcohol, so... Mm. Yeah, okay, I'll take that. Alright, I'm heading out. I did enough damage for today, so let's Delta. And go all the way back to the first floor. To the streets I go. Yep. Everyone's quiet. Everyone is so quiet. Let's keep it that way. Those who exact justice do so on behalf of our Lord. You've done well, V. I know this isn't always easy. And that's why I applaud your decision today. Contract closed. Nice. I killed someone for over $5,000. Another media killed herself. Scream sheets are saying it was work-related stress, but our folks are calling foul play. So, think you can pick something up? Got more deets attached. Something's rotten in the city of dreams. A series of suicides, a rash of self-destruction, the contagnation, the contag. Tax, whatever. Mostly targets politicians, corpos, journalists, and police officers. The latest victim was Zola Barnes, a journalist who fell into the tracks at Memorial Park Station. Her death was officially ruled a suicide, but Barnes' parents say that she went to meet one of her informants at the station and that she never would have taken her own life. I know, I know, that's what all parents say. Seems like the jury's still out. Nobody really knows what happened because every last shred of CCTV footage was wiped clean. You know what? That right there, suspicious. Like, she didn't kill herself. It was, it was a plot. Her parents tracked down the witnesses, but they didn't want to talk. And what's more, Militech took a keen interest in the whole thing. It's all turn to make heads or tails of this. Head to the station, breach the servers, and 
download any CCTV Blade files. I'll have my code monkeys try to recover the deleted footage. P.S. Oh, and by the way, at the time Sola was working on a piece about Brad Norwood, a Melitech fanboy in the Night City Council. Anyway, looks that piece is never getting published. P.P.S. Transferring you Militech authorization that will get you into the station. Okay, that's cute. So I'll just walk on in como si na, and I won't have any issues, right? Right? Recon support? Damn, how the hell am I supposed to sneak in? I'm not trying to make any type of noise. Wait, hold on. Can I distract people? Nah. I'll just wait until they like move away or something. Damn, come on. Okay, let me go to the other side. Like, I want to dive right in and just mess everything up, but I don't want to make a big scene about it either, so... Damn. Um... Distraction? No. Is there any way I can, like, distract everyone because this- Oh, wait. Right here. This should help. We have Edith Kutaga in custody, awaiting further orders. Do you confirm she was wearing a listening device? Confirmed. Understood. Eliminate Edith Kutaga for terrorist activity motivated by anti-corporate and anti-capitalist ideologies? Copy that. Can I sneaky sneak sneak? Oh. Shit. Damn, this is... Run. Nope, you didn't see me. You didn't see me. Yo, I just ran off like that. Holy shit, this is fantastical. I see a camera there, so let me turn off this device. And I'm just gonna go in. Okay, so what's going on? Ooh. There's like two people. I don't know what to do. Is there any way I can like, you know, sneak? Because... Huh? I think I saw something. I'm on my way to investigate. Yes, please investigate. Hurry up. Move out the way. Like, okay. perfect. Grab, and then I'm just gonna do a non-lethal takedown. And then I'm gonna pick up the body. Yeah, I'm gonna move the body over here. Drop the body right here. Okay, so... Right here? The hell am I... What am I looking at? Cyberpunk, please tell me where the fuck am I supposed to be looking at? Reach the main server? Wait, right here, right? Okay, fucking assholes.
Okay. This is really intense. Oh, the camera! Fuck! Turn off. Fuck! They know I'm here. Oh, shit. Let's go. They know I'm here. Damn, now I gotta kill everyone in the whole world. And the camera's right there. Shit. Alright, I have little time, so... Okay, cool. There you go. Shut up. That's right. Stick to the wall. Thank you. Great. Yeah, you can stick to the wall, too. While you're at it. Who else is coming? Damn, now they know I'm here. I can't really do good sneak attacks, bro. I can't. I don't know what this is, and I don't care. Alright, now I gotta steal the CCTV footage, so... Let's steal the data. And then get out. Because that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to get out! Okay, so... Oh, shit! A robot! Oh, my God. What's this? Got the data, no time to lose. Delta, the fuck out of here. You don't have to tell me twice. Cause I ain't trying to lose my life. I'm running. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Sorry, sorry, bye. Ooh. Luckily, it's all over. Handled it like a true profesh. Yes, I, I got did. The data. You're in the clear. Closing the gig. Yes. And I have my life still intact. Pretty happy. That was so intense. Like, look at this. Thank God for med kits, because I would have been dead ages ago at this point. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next time.